Welcome to the Old Timer Centre. My name is Philip Tarrant and I'm going to be talking to you about this 1986 BMW 635 CSI. It's an absolutely stunning condition. It's got the very popular at the time BBS mesh alloy wheels. It's got black leather interior and the four-speed automatic transmission. It's done 110,000 miles and is one of the best 6 Series I've seen. The 6 Series is a pretty special car considering it was in production for about 13 years. It came out in 1976 and was basically well, way ahead of its time in terms of electronics. Um, Four-speed automatic transmissions were pretty rare. It's an electric transmission. You've got economy and sport. In sport, it even locks up the torque converter. It's got air conditioning, trip computer, and is, to this day, one of my favourite BMWs of all time. It's a four-seater. The leather is in excellent condition for its age. It's got the three-spoke motorsport steering wheel. It's rust-free. It's got the 3.5 litre straight six. I think every single six series produced at the time was a straight six and BMW are known for their straight sixes um, very nice wheels some people I've spoken to you know in the BMW club and whatnot call it the basket weave wheel I know it as the mesh style BBS rim it's even got the same rim as a spare It is badged as a 633 CSI. I'm not sure why, uh, because 1986, the 633 was discontinued. And I'm, uh, the car is an import, obviously. That's why it's in miles. I'm not sure if that's got something to do with it. Uh, but getting back to the condition, the car's just come in. I haven't even washed it, shamed it or anything. It's been in storage for a while. It's going to a mechanic today for a full check over and service. Um, having said that, it does drive perfectly at the present time. There are some receipts here. It's got the tools. The receipts are for pretty minor things, and I think this page here, this BMW page, was just because it was on display at obviously a BMW club meeting. It just says 86 E24 635 CSI also known as shark nose etc four speed automatic if you look under here there's the spare and it is the same as what's on the car which is really quite rare the other thing is the 633 wheel was a very different looking alloy wheel and you would have seen that as the spare all the lights windows every panel really every part of this car is immaculate it really needs to be seen to be appreciated so if you are interested in this car and you're living in sydney please come and have a look at it and even if you're interstate that's something i would certainly suggest doing you can even leave a deposit subject to seeing the vehicle um, it does have an updated stereo i'm sure if you went online with a bit of looking around you could probably find an original looking becker for the car uh, the back seat literally doesn't look like it's been sat in and the same goes for the passenger seat really does have a sunroof um, sunroof opens and closes perfectly um, we'll have a look in the engine bay actually um, it was way ahead of its time in terms of 
technology, but even little things like the aerodynamic mirrors. It was one of the first mirrors to have a gap through here. They painted the centre here black um, to give it the look of pillarless. There was also um, special materials used in the chrome work so that it didn't react with the, uh, with the rest of the car. Looking under the bonnet, again, it looks very, very good. Even the oil is nice and clean. It's probably difficult to see there, but that's nice and clean. As I said, it starts and dries well. The air conditioning's cold. Um, it's got a couple of compliance plates. So it looks like it went to Queensland in 2000. So that's when it's had its modification plate. Um, and this car we acquired from a collector. I mean, even looking at the paintwork, you'd expect some stone chips over the years. Yeah, it really does look incredible. There's the original plate from Germany, made in Germany, etc. The colour, Luxe Beige, metallic. But it really is very impressive. When you go online, I'm sure there's six series anywhere from probably 10,000 to 40,000 and everything in between. I think this is very well priced for its condition. And with the bonnet, obviously, you saw how it opened up to close it. It's quite elegant, really. You push that in, it pulls it closed. So if you are looking at them and you open the bonnet, Please don't slam the bonnet. <laughs> um, but yeah, no, it's it's just come into us. We're going to get this checked out today. Uh, it's an '86, so it's it had been in production for about ten years when this one came out. The later one's quite desirable. It had a bit of a facelift, but I actually love the chrome bumpers. I love the chrome bumper work on the earlier models. Again, all the power windows work. The paint works excellent. It, it's like it's been kept in a garage its entire life. Um, the, the history and paint work on the car is very limited. So again, that's why we're getting it to a mechanic for a full check over. Um, if you're interested in buying the car and you wanted a mechanical inspection, I'd be more than happy uh, to have that done. Or if you'd arrange someone to have a look at it, we have every bit of confidence in this car. And uh, I'm certainly very proud to offer it to you from the Old Timer Centre. We've been doing this for over 20 years. We specialise in European cars just like this car here. We don't get as many old timers as uh, we would like. And that's basically not because they're not around, it's because... We're very fussy like our customers and we, we really try to buy the best available. If you have any specific questions about the car, please give us a call. We're contacts on 029569999. And we're located in Sydney. And we look forward to hearing from you very soon.